These are all military objectives. Some are general, some very specific. In the United States, they are ultimately political choices. For me, this means the President, as Commander-in-Chief, submitting these types of high-level military objectives to Congress for approval, and then working to achieve those objectives by proposing more specific military options to accomplish our national goals. The President proposes objectives and what is needed to accomplish those objectives, and the Congress reviews, debates, and modifies the objectives and proposals to meet those objectives and appropriates the resources it decides necessary to meet what it decides best serves the nation's military objectives.